Hey everybody, George Chamberlain here watching your dollars on this uh, Thursday, the 18th of uh, October. Spent a lot of time talking about jobs reports and stuff like that. This one's a little bit different. Um, uh, a lot of sports fans out there and, and you know there's something special about having a, a sports hero. Ozzie Smith for a long time was a big hero here in San Diego when he played shortstop for the Padres. After a few years he went over to the St. Louis Cardinals and continued a great major league career. Well, that was a report yesterday that Ozzy, uh, and, and, and the reason for doing this he says is for estate planning purposes, I'll let it go with that, is going to auction off uh, the 13 Golden Glove awards that he received during his career, two of those with the Padres in 1980 and 1981. He's also going to auction off a group of World Series rings that he earned uh, of course, while playing with the Cardinals, not with with the Padres. So we're seeing a lot more athletes doing this. Don Larson, another guy with San Diego roots, was born here, still still lives here, was a pitcher for the New York Yankees. In 1956, he pitched a perfect game in a World Series against the Dodgers. Only time there's ever been a perfect game pitched in the World Series. He's going to auction off the actual uniform that he was wearing on that day. You know, these guys are great athletes, but if you take a look back in those days, they weren't making a lot of money. They, they were doing okay. I'm not saying they weren't weren't doing okay, but they weren't making anywhere near the kinds of monies, even on an uh, inflation-adjusted basis, that baseball players and other athletes are getting these days. And so a lot of people think these guys are bucks up, but they're really not. And sometimes this is something that they, while they hate to get rid of it, they, it, it does allow them to have some, some comfort and some financial peace of mind. Ozzy, in a quote, said something to the effect is that he really hopes the people who buy these things will be fans who will appreciate owning those pieces of history. Watching your dollars, I'm George Chamberlain. Have a good one.